All right, folks, looking at our storm tracker today at Kansas and Chestnut. Looking good outside. A few clouds this morning and some spotty rain showers in Springfield this morning. The rain is moving on in. It's going to stay that way for the remainder of the day. Plan for the rain for the next couple of hours. Looking at Lake of the Ozarks right now from the high V camera. Not as much rain yet in central Missouri. I think their chances here will increase as we go into the afternoon hours. OK, that heavy rain is still located in western Missouri and eastern Kansas, but it is moving this way. Temperatures now have cooled quite a bit. 49 in Monette now, 50 in Springfield. That's after we were near 60 degrees this morning. So the clouds and the cool air and the rain all moving this way. Meanwhile, mid 50s up in central Missouri. Leave the bike at home today. Put it in the garage. Mid 50s through the daytime today will be pretty stable and cool on those temperatures. Rain throughout the day may be becoming more scattered as we go into late this evening and for the overnight. Recorded rainfall so far, Carthage, Missouri, the Mesonet station there recorded about 4.4 inches of rainfall so far this morning and more rain on the way for them. So a flash flood warning is in play for parts of Jasper County, Barton County and Vernon County also looking at again some heavier rain just south of Nevada, north of Lamar. Otherwise, most of us are waiting for our heavy rain to get here. We've seen about a half inch so far here in Springfield, locally more as we're starting to see that heavier rain now move in from the west side of town. That rain is going to be ongoing for a big chunk of the afternoon hours. Our next storm for Friday. Here it is. This will be a weather maker tonight and tomorrow for some. We've got a slight chance of maybe a storm or two in western Missouri on your Friday afternoon as that thing swings on by. So for the rest of today, I think we'll still see the main wave of energy for rain glide on through for the afternoon. By this evening, again, rain tapering off. Still scattered chances, though, as we go into midnight through 5 a.m. And then we'll get a storm chance in here going into Friday morning. But the rainfall from today and today only could still be quite heavy. We've already seen four inches out near Joplin. I think that stripe of heavier rain will continue to move eastward. And we could still see some pockets that pick up maybe two to three inches of additional rainfall. So looking at Friday morning, Friday morning drivers met once again with a round of showers and a few thunderstorms. Severe weather unlikely with this round here. OK, that'll use up some of the energy for the morning, but the area to watch for Friday will be in the afternoon. Eastern Kansas, Western Missouri, somewhere along the state line. I think we will see maybe just a storm or two develop out there and move to the northeast with the potential for hail and wind for the afternoon wrapping up before midnight. So good news there. Just a storm or two for Friday afternoon, but they could be strong to severe. Saturday is mostly dry. We go into Saturday evening and really Saturday overnight. More energy comes out of Kansas and Oklahoma. Wave after wave after wave possible there. We could be doing a lot more rain for folks in west central Missouri for Saturday night into Sunday morning with more strong to severe weather possible on your Sunday as that zone redevelops. So for Friday, again, just a storm or two likely in the west. Probably looking at a slight chance of maybe some hail and some wind. For Saturday, those storms out of Kansas could be strong to severe as they move into western Missouri with mainly a wind hazard there. And again, more scattered storms Sunday and then a dry and a warm pattern to go into next week. Guys. All right. Thank you, Tom.